Sorry, I had to be quiet to be a little tricky with, <coughs> tricky with you. <laughs> Alright. I think that was one of my problems last tournament, too, is that I would keep talking to chat even though I had like 30 seconds left. Hmm. That was being sneaky. <laughs> Watch me when I get quiet. <laughs> sneaky things will happen when I'm quiet. I see you, the gaming route. One, two, three. You said you keep losing. It could be just one of those days. Also, um, I'm curious. Like, did you give yourself a chance to practice this time control? Because I usually do better time controls than I do on a regular basis, which seems obvious, but you know, if you don't do the time control, you're gonna have trouble because you're gonna things are gonna happen that you wouldn't normally anticipate. Which is an interesting thing. I only really I can't say only, but I often get caught off guard by players that are lower rated than me. Players that are higher rated usually play moves I expect, but I don't always respond correctly to players that don't play what I think they should be playing. Which, you know, it's a weakness on my part. Sneaky, sneaky. Hey, Green Tea 999. So my Lee Chess rating is apparently 1844 for Blitz. Uh, my highest rating I've had on Blitz is probably about 2000 when I tried hard, hard. But um, I'm trying to get to a point where I just kind of understand the game better. Let's see what to do. All right, so one thing to note is that if you do make a mistake, take a deep breath, chill for a minute, see what, see what your position has to offer you. All right. Hmm. Wouldn't it be nice if we were older? But as I was saying, yeah, um, you can definitely get some practice in by playing players that you know. Um, joining our Discord, great idea. Like, I know I keep, like, promoting it, but it's been such a beautiful thing. I love to see that everybody's engaging each other, asking each other questions, sharing their games. It reminds me of just, like, when I was growing up and I was playing in chess clubs. It's incredibly helpful. All right, so, Takala, you saw my trickery. Hmm. This is tricky. Not exactly sure what to do. So if you go to my bio, there's a link tree in there, and you'll see the virtual um, chess club. Join that. And then there's like a um, how this works channel, but you can go straight to um, chess events, and you'll see the link in there. You'll be able to figure out once you get to the Discord, really. But if you have any questions, feel free to let me know or ask the general chat. They're more than welcome to help as well. I'm being attacked, but this is not a good idea. So I'm just waiting to get paired again. I'm currently in first, but I was also the highest rated, so I have a bit of an advantage. But, you know, it's a long game, and my friend uh, Takala J, uh, he berserks. So if he berserks, he gets more points for victories. So if I mess up and he wins berserk games, I mean, <laughs> he might pass me. Good game. 
Hey, Green Tea, you won a game in a tournament. Didn't you just say, like, you don't think you're good enough? I love it. I love that. You just said you weren't good enough, and the next thing you know, you just won a game. Bruh, how? <laughs> Johnny, how are you doing this? I, like, want you to win now. <laughs> this is insane. I have not lost a single game. You've lost two, and now we're going to play each other. Berserk. Oh my god, he's berserking. Oh no. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I am just in awe. So Dylan, tips on getting better at chess? I'm being biased today because this is what we're doing. Play in tournaments. It'll encourage you to want to improve your game for sure. And it'll your weaknesses will get exploited right away. Against players that might not be even be as good as you, but with the time pressure and the pressure of being in a tournament, it'll force you to really think about your behaviors, the choices you make, the openings you know. It'll really motivate you. So I say play in tournaments. I highly recommend you play and join a club. Of course, I'm really biased towards ours, but I mean, getting to know people and play and motivate yourself to play more and more is just exciting. Chess typically has been an independent sport, but it doesn't have to be. I think that's just. I mean, it's nice that you can be self-taught and learn things, but personally, I'd rather be part of a community. Woo! I'm glad I learned to stop talking to chat when I have, like, no time left. <laughs> glad I learned that. <laughs> Yay!